Let me get the game going. Oh, but first, I gotta do this. Hold on. You wait right there. I will get this going. There we go. Get the menu playing. Okay. Here we go. Okay. So let me show you what happened, chat. So, as you know, I like to play this game from time to time on my own. It's a pretty good game after all. Did I turn the music back up? Sure did. So check this out. I'll show you the two runs I did. Okay. So I got this run here. This run here was about 60 damage away from winning. But I got hit by the keen shot vulnerable combo and just died. Now, I could have won. But I just didn't have the final push required. Also, my, my draws were really bad. Like... I did not get fires at Enna at the first turn. I did not get already sun in the first turn. Like, uh, uh, my first hand was garbage. Also, chat, there's been an update for this game that has changed the, uh, that it changed it. So, previously, Sage could only pull from two relics at the start. And that's the, the lamp and the bow. I actually prefer when she takes the, the bow and gets the status cards. But this run that I played here, this run right here, she pulled out the goblet. She pulled out the goblet that steals all of your non, uh, your non shiny relics. <laughs> Which I was just like, okay. But it didn't matter. You know why? Because I have this. So as you can see, I have a lot of red mana. I have, uh, where was it? Here. I have too big to fail times two. Right? I had too big to fail times two. And I had the smart speaker with all out. So all of my burst damage was tripled. I entered burst on the first turn with basically like 60 plus barrier. That was my first turn, every turn. Triple burst into uh into like 60 barrier i killed junko in two turns <laughs> she died so fast so fast nothing else mattered i only needed the shining relics like that's the thing but the smart speaker did its role before i lost it anyway and i got a bunch of red, like good uh, red ones and the firestone so i killed her so fast so fucking fast <laughs> And that was the last hard mode clear I needed. So now, chat, what we're gonna do is we're gonna try. We're gonna go with Barrier Reimu. Because Barrier Reimu is very good. And we're gonna try Looney Mode. Enemies have more life, hit harder, and have more dangerous moves. Alright, let's do it. Alright, alright, let's see what we got. I got my hot pocket. I'll help as much as I can, Reimu. Let's see. Random exhibit. Add Rainbow to the mana base when acquired. The player gains 5 extra maximum life. Not better than that. Choose a card from the deck to transform into a Maiden's Aerial Graze. Or choose a card from the deck to- These are really not good. Yeesh. Yeesh. I could ditch a card early on, but like... Nah, I think I'd rather just have the money. I might need those weak shoot cards. Take the HP as per usual. Alright, so obviously the first place we're going. Where do we go with 110 money? I don't have anything I want to upgrade, but I might get something along the way. Let's go down. Let's just head to a gap. Let's figure out what's going on here. That's such a bad starting hand, dude. <laughs> I 
That's so bad. That's just terrible. Uh... Absolute dookie. I'm getting my ass kicked by the first enemies. Kill. Objective kill. Hmm. Alright. Money Orbs Draw card AOE damage Orb Those hand that was that was just garbage hands. <laughs> that was a bad hand. Accurate attack right now. Um, let's see. Built some barrier. More hot pocket. You got me. Hmm. the grays, preserves my barrier. Now we're, now, that is a better ham. That's a better ham. Much better. Oh my god. Never mind. Act one, man. Act one. Just pop it. Out of my sight. Okay. Whenever a card is exiled, gain three block. I like... I like that card. Next is an event. What do you think, chat? I, I I can upgrade whatever I get here. This is AOE, but it costs a lot. AOE is very, very good early on. I think I actually want the AOE. And I'll upgrade that so it upgrades more cards and I have more uh, like upgrade sustain. I'm gonna get the that. Ah, ooh. Gain a random exhibit. We're saying uh, no fluff. Yes fluff. Yes fluff. Heavy base drum. Three defense cards are played. That actually is not bad for Rainbow because you know if I get my if I get my barrier enablers, I'll be I'll be golden. All right. So upgrade this. So does more damage. Upgrades more cards. And does a. 
<clears throat> Alright. I'm not touching an elite enemy. <laughs> I, I don't want to chat. I don't want to fight an elite enemy. Fuck. <laughs> Lunatic Aya, I can't even hit her. Like, she has two grazes. I don't have any accurate. I have no accurate. I need to draw... I need to draw three attack cards in a turn to deal damage to her. That's just not happening. <laughs> I just can't do that. There's no way I can do that. I'd rather go to a gap than a shop, but I, I'm gonna miss an event here, so... That sucks. Did not upgrade the defense card. Oh well. Get rid of it. Spirit down. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Five block, five block. Thirteen block. Upgrades, these are now cheaper and I'll be able to use them next turn. Deal three damage and get a little barrier. A little barrier. Alright. Nineteen. Alright. I can... I can throw those at her. Uh, let me see. I might be able to get the rabbit. Three grazes. Can I get that? Let's see. Gotcha. Give me back my money. Okay, well, free fly is good. More mana generation. I actually like this card a lot, by the way. And this is block and reflection. Let me see. I'm on my way to a gap. I like free fly for more mana to use for more cards. Hmm. I know, I've had good experiences with this card. This card is really good. This card is really good because you can just keep getting like you keep getting a damage card, and it's accurate to boot. Let's see. Uh, free fly is also really good, but I like having like ability cards. I like having ability cards pre-upgraded because you you have to play them the one time, right? Um. Hmm. I'm gonna go for mana generation. Okay. Hmm.
Like right here. Look at that. I'm gonna take that 10 to the face. So I have more mana to play with. I'm dying, Squirtle. Rainbow, your heart is breaking. Oh, I can do it. Completely block all damage. Go ahead, buff your firepower. I don't care. Once I pull my massive A AOE damage card again. Yeah. Uh... Huh. I don't have to kill you? No, actually. It's not. Oh, I'm pissed. Dude. I can't kill her with it. So it'll be at 1 HP and then it's gonna do like fucking 20 to me. All right. I can't kill it again. Well, at least it can't kill me back. All right. It's fine, I'm alive. Yin Yang Ruin. Whenever Rainbow plays Yin Yang Orb, gain two Chat, I have seen this card so many times. Oh, they changed it. Oh, they changed it. Chat, this card used to cost you three life when you upgraded it. Now they made it cost less uh, on upgrade. Interesting. Binding Border is really good. It's accurate. I don't like this card because I never have yin yang, like crazy yin yang support. You know? I never really have uh, yin yang support, so I just take damage and I don't even, like, utilize it. I'll take the border. And I am going to upgrade my free fly. And I am going to suffer at the hands of. Ah, oh, shit. Don't do it. You can't dodge this. Ouch. Half dead. He's half dead. Man. Good. Good. Celebratory bite. Mm. Man. This is the third time this card has shown up. I think it's trying to tell me something. What's next? Race and box. You know what? Fine. I will entrench my body. Just for you, Biakudim. Secret cloak. I think this I, I think this relic is actually better than it it seems. Just have him block for a fat hand. Uh 
I'm not fight. I'm not fighting an elite, dude. I'm not doing it. It can't be done. Give me my orbs. All right. It's got reflection built in as well. Hmm. Don't hurt me, bro. Don't hurt me. Get the orbs. Thank you. Good stuff. Twenty block focus light. Uh, why? <laughs> what are you doing? Also consistent with Vyakuden's laws of motion. Can I have a different card? Please? I'm not trying to entrench my body, you know? Let me see. Do I take another one? It's basically just my block card. But with reflection damage, which is, you know, it's good. I'm going to entrench my body again. Oh. Yeah, sure. Whenever three attack cards are played, game one spirit. Okay. Brick card. I'm heading to a shop, so I'll just eat it. I'll just eat it. Why not? What you got, champ? Dowsing rods, sunflower, take copter, endless banquet. Oh, I saw this card uh, when I played with uh, Marissa, but it didn't have a. Uh, it didn't have uh, a description. There's no change. At the start of Rainbow's turn, gain two temporary firepower. See, that's interesting, because that actually, like, that's... <clears throat> it becomes three, okay. So here's what's interesting about that. Rainbow has a few abilities that take effect by having her buffs wear off and whatnot, and also she has another ability card that converts temporary firepower into true firepower. So this card right here seems like it's not that great, but it's supposed to synergize with other cards that utilize the fact that, like, uh, that Dimensional Rift card I had. That card is, like, and then Reimu has, like, the this one over here, the Three Gods, where it's temporary. Well, like, she has stuff like that. There's also Blink. Hmm. Red Rainbow also has, yeah, multi-hits, which work really, really well with firepower. It's a good ability card. It is a good ability card. Uh, question is... Do I want to... I can't even play this until it's upgraded. I have to upgrade that to be able to use it without free fly, so I can't even use that right now. And the next gap, I have 43 HP. Okay, so if I could greed this and fight Marissa with 43 HP. Oh, I'm greeting it. If I lose, it was just never meant to be. I forgot there was an enemy in front of me. <laughs> God, there was an enemy in front of me. Oh shit. Okay.
Well. Would really like the Pagoda card right now. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Get blinked, idiot. Get blinked. Never underestimate this card. Okay. I actually can play this. I do have enough mana to play this without what to call. Chat, how hard do you think Marissa hits? Do you think she hits hard enough that my 10 block cards can totally bail me out? 40 plus. Alright, I'll drink the fucking tea. I'll drink the tea. Defense! 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 Three grays. That's gone for good now. Graze is gone. Plop. This card always seems to take a little bit for it to register. doing numbers <laughs> ah! just a little crunchy why is this in my hand Oh my god. Bro, I am still alive. I am still alive. Gotcha. Woo! We living. What we got? No light. Adds neutral to the mana base for each neutral mana spent per basic card. That's really good. 
firepower, then add one refract to the discard pile, and then dark mana, Marissa's cards. I like some of uh, Raymu's dark cards, but that's a hard, uh, I don't really know if you can play with multiple mana on this, uh, this shit. Neutral mana and, sh uh, increasing the strength of my neutral cards. Or red mana. But this one comes at a danger. This one's dangerous because you need a lot of... Hmm. I like this one from Marissa because she does a lot of damage anyway. This starts you with mana to use, but otherwise it's just an it's just an enabler for Marissa cards and also dark stuff, which again Rainbow has a really good dark card called the Gap Yokai that I really like, but I don't know if it's worth it. I think I might get the mallet. Oh. You are my favorite card. I love that card, dude. Exile that card from the hand and add a yin yang orb in the, to the hand. This for. Hmm. I just don't think this card is that great. Anyway, I'm taking my border card. Alright. What's next? Hmm. Hmm. Gappy. I take the redstone because I like, uh, I take it with Marissa. Because I always stack the ever-living buck out of my deck anyway. Hmm. That's fine. A little weenie, but it's okay. <clears throat> uh. Woo! Part of the plan. Two damage. This body has been entrenched. I win. Mm. Another Pagoda Glare. <clears throat> Tiny hitbox. Gives you Graze, but also applies Vulnerable, so you gotta be careful when you use it. But otherwise, it's a pretty good card. Uh, I'm gonna take the Graze. Junkie. You know what? You know what? <laughs> yes, actually. But which one do I give up? What do I give up for this? I guess it'd be my light mana, because otherwise I can't play half my cards. Oh, this looks so awkward. Bro, this looks so awkward. <clears throat> 18. There we 
we go. That'll graze through both of them and I'll get my barrier for that. Okay. Nine times two. Right, I want them upgraded. You're alive? Why? How fucking dare you be alive right now? Whatever. Ah. Uh. Bop. Yeah, when they're upgraded, I want to run into Shimmy. That's what I want to run into. Because then I can use two ma neutral manas for it. <clears throat> yeah, now I can get the Filthus World card. <laughs> That's the one that costs three neutral mana. Good, good, good. Hmm. Shoot. Here it comes. Big block number, big block number. Upgrades, people, upgrades. Not that one. Uh, make blink cost less to use. Apply more grays. More of that. That can be upgraded by Pagoda. Bink. Bink, 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 bink. <clears throat> All right. Uh, no, I'm okay with what I have. You can have my glasses, though. All right, I need events. That's what I need. Run into. Sh I'm looking for shimmy. I'm looking for shimmy. That's what I want. What do I want to get rid of here? Can I even use this anymore? It takes all of my light mana to play that card. You can have it. You can have it. There are, there are better barrier cards for sure. I have to give her something. Alright. AoE! And he thought about what he did. Um, hmm. Oh. Hold on. Pretty good. 42 damage. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. My spirit is up. Okay. Hmm. 
I get a turn to kick her ass with. Deal zero damage. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Let's change that though. There you go. Alright. Blink on her. Will that remove my temporary fire power? Okay, it does. Oh, wait. Because it costs more now, I can use more. <laughs> I can use more neutral mana to play it. Ah, yes. Yes, I see. I understand. Hey, now, this is good. Spell card 15 barrier, 15 reflection. I like this card. Free upgraded, too. What does he want? What do you want from me? I don't have a lot of color mana for this anymore. Feels like a wasted card. Can get additional grays. If I play this raw, I can get eight block and I mean that's not a lot. Maybe that card isn't as good as I want it to be right now because of this neutral mana shit. If anything, it's worth investing in these. Just for the raw damage that they can potentially do. Hmm. What? Uh, upgrading my basics is kind of lame. <laughs> it's kind of lame, dude. I'll take more grays. Okay. Just gonna... Just gonna press this. much block. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Barrier. Miracle Mallet being a bit silly. Mask of Hope. TNT. 25 damage AoE on the fourth turn. Give me that. Events. 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 We're doing an elite. We're doing an elite. With one barrier remain. Look at that reflection.
<clears throat> Jesus. <laughs> yes. That's it. I'm getting me mallet. And there's the TNT. That's the good stuff. That's the good stuff. One, two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yin Yang Ruin, Ascension Kick. Pre upgraded. Ascension kick is. Yeah, why not? If it upgrades from Pagoda or something. Oh, Yuko, okay. I currently don't have a way to draw cards. I don't have a way to draw cards right now. Well, that's one way to do it. Hmm. I need draw cards. I need draw cards, dude. Okay. Can make this a free draw, which I think is honestly, like, that feels like not the best choice, but at the same time, the way I prioritize my upgrades, it's usually mana cost comes first. Making things cost less means I can use more. This sucks. This 100% sucks. Huh. It's AoE, but it would do six damage and that's it. Be nine, actually. Bite it. Pogoda can be real annoying. But now they're in Pagoda range, so fight Pagoda. Perfect. Three Grays will dodge that entirely. Five Vulnerable Stack. Throw the Ying Yang more better. Okay. Pokero has potential to do so much damage. But I think I like Notori less. <laughs> Notori's more annoying. Fifty barrier. Don't worry, that TNT is coming next turn, so that mask is dead no matter what. Well, there's also my reflection, which I admittedly forgot about when I said that. Pop. 20 damage. 21 block. 10 damage. Just, just press and block because I'm allowed to. That's all it is. Does that say 10 times 4? It does, doesn't it?
Well. <laughs> Look at him go. Okay. Sixteen damage. Tiny hitbox. You cannot hit me. Give up. I was kind of hoping she summoned a mask there. Maybe think about the things you do. The things we do. <laughs> Raymo. Barrier Reimu is silly, dude. All right, there's the mask. Pumpy. She'll give me a bunch, and he'll give me a little bit as well. Start of combat, apply two lock on. That's just not good. You want to talk about good? That right there that I just picked up, that's a good card. New Year's Festival is good too. No, this is the same card. This is the same card. Cause you, it pays for itself if you have barrier. All right. I have based on temporary firepower instead of barrier. What? Oh, you, wait. Oh. Oh, you're right. You're right, because it says temporary firepower there on the side. Uh oh. That's a problem. Hmm. All right. No big deal. that over again, shall we? Barrier. Oh no, I couldn't I couldn't attack anyway, that's why. Never mind. Uh Okay. Channel is currently gone, yes, because YouTube is a bunch of fucking geniuses. So I'm waiting for I'm waiting for them to get back to me and fix it. But of course they wouldn't do that. They wouldn't do that quickly. That would that would be a uh, good service. Can't have good service here. Not in this house. 20 block. Do I even need 20 block? No, I don't. I can do reflection though. Get him nice and juicy for the TNT. Oh, yeah, because. Yeah, this thing is gonna stack up on me for a while, isn't it? No, it's only three. Okay. 
let's see. 10, 10, yep. Nice. That means I can get my free fly up. Pop! Alright. Uh, yin yang orb. Spell card do. Barrier up. And throw a yin yang orb at her. Call it a day. Alright. Temporary firepower, huh? That's not gonna hit me, actually. Because I'm going to do this. Alright. Cool. It is not going to hit me. Ting. Again? Huh. At the end of the turn. I'm currently weak. I can't do anything with this at the moment. So... Fuck it, let's try and make some more heavy neutral cost attacks. I haven't done a lot of damage to her. I need to fix that. Okay. Alright, alright. Twenty three damage, fifteen damage. All right, not bad. You want to know the worst part about the whole fiasco chat? Is the bot that took over my account in the first place treated it better than YouTube did? That is just so fucking sad. Like. That's like, just depressing. The bot that took over my channel privated all my videos. That's all it did. YouTube deleted my entire fucking channel. Just all inspiring, man. Fucking all inspiring. Nice. 42 damage. Yes, sir. A little more barrier for me. Don't mind if I do. I'm getting chipped down by her law of morality thing, so I gotta speed it up here. Speed it up a bit here. Alright. Let's see. I don't need block right now. I need you to apply vulnerable. Yeah. One. Two, three. Alright. Six. It's getting a little dicey. It's 
getting a little dicey. Uh... I have quite suddenly run out of turns. I actually have temporary firepower. <laughs> oi, oi, oi. Oi, 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 oi. Lucky. Okay. Could have been worse. Plates, toolbox, more neutral mana after every two combats, gain a tool, label taking gives dark, and then plates. Great three random cards at the end of the combat. More neutral mana? Even more neutral mana, dude. I would need Shimmy to show up. <laughs> I need, I would need Shimmy to show up. Oh man. The odds of that. Think of the value. You mean the value? Two tools every two combats. Nah, Shimmy can appear in the third one. I'm, that was like the first time I ever saw her, I think. I'm gonna go for the upgrades. Because I can upgrade the cards. And there it is. The stupidest card in the game. <laughs> there she is. Ah, wrong. Cards cost one less this turn. It's pretty good. I never used that card. But this is a dumb card. Converts all block into barrier. And we're getting that upgraded right now. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Well. All right then. Six chain block. Barrier. Reflection. Catch some of these. All right. It matters not. Entrench your body. Lower their power. Prevent them from hitting you. Hit them back. All right. The TNT is coming. TNT is coming, don't worry. Twenty four block. Don't mind if I do. TNT is coming. Don't worry. Meow. Job's done. Job's done.
You love to see it. You love to see it. Above the realm, full moon hell. Now I love me some above the realm. Let me just say that. I love this card. So I'm taking it. Alright. The amulet got eaten up. That's accurate, so I can't stop that. 16. 42. Block that shit. Above the realm. Around the world. Around the world. Job's done. That's fine. Hmm. This is quite fine. Got blasted. Stop doing that. That's it's kind of annoying. Cut that out. Huh. Entrench your body. Entrench your body. Alright. Me and you, General Probe. Sorry, that's the Terminator. Nine times three. It's like I just don't even care. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Yoish. There's endless banquets. Wandering heaven upgrades everything in the hand. Whenever Raymond loses a buff, gain four barrier. I like this because of my neutral cards. This guarantees I'll always have temporary firepower. But no, I want upgrades. Shit, not you. <laughs> Breath of the Whale. Odd numbers lose one random man at the start of even numbers, add two of that type. Or, thank god I checked. <laughs> I was not about, no, nah, I'm just taking the Breath of the Whale. Give me the special. Good thing I checked. Wait, what? Due to the wine, she forgets the bill and something important. Why am I... Oh, I get to leave a card behind? Oh, I didn't even realize that was an additional effect. Huh. Oh shit, what do I ditch? I like my cards. Homing Amulet is extremely situational. So maybe I ditch that. I won't need it after a while. Temporary firepower only comes from like one card I have. Yeah, fuck it. Just forget it. That's fine. I'll ditch it. I wanted to upgrade the Great Hakrade Barrier. Because it makes it cheaper. And it's a, it's a silly card. Trade expanding border. You know what, chat? I'm not even using this card anymore. Game five barrier, return an exile card to the hand. That's not that great. Neither is that. I mean, can be, but not really, because I don't have a way to build it up. It's not even accurate. Why would I never take the 800G? Because it puts two cards in your deck. That when you draw them, limits the amount of cards you can play. I don't need that much money. I'll just lose. If you pull that card in your hand and suddenly I can't do anything, I just you just lose. 
That's a stupid idea. That's why it gives you so much money is because the risk is astronomical. I only have like two cards that exile themselves. Actually, getting Blink out of the discard pile is pretty good. You know what? I'm gonna do it. I'll trade you this one. Give me crossing the border. Give me that. Alright. Get her out of here. Okay. So what's next? I can make that cheaper, but it's for one-time use. I kind of want to go to a shop. So let's go to a shop. And an elite. Alright. Why did they all just get two grays? Dude. Well. Play it takes four to use that. TNT is coming soon. Throw another one at it. one block or graze it I'm grazing it let's see random enemy three times pop TNT TNT Real Misfortune does 15 damage, and the amount of times it does uh, it attacks is based on the amount of uh, misfortunes you have in your deck. Oh, wow. Okay. Trace on. You're not, you're not, you're the wrong small creature. I was looking for a different small creature. Start of Raymond's turn, one random card in the hand gains pure. Well. Finds one of the exposition's lost treasures, gain a random rare exhibit. Now I wish I went to a gap. What we got? <clears throat> if I light manage, you just gain life. Cookie. I have to upgrade it. Start of Raymond's turn, two random cards in the hand game, pure. So what pure does chat is it removes the, the cost. It removes the elemental cost of my cards. Like, so like this card, for example, would be free. This card would cost one, this card would cost one. So. It's a cookie, my guy. <laughs> it's a good day. It's a cookie. It's a full heal. One firepower, one fire seems misfortune. And then heal. Are any of these cards worth getting? I guess there's a draw card. It's pretty good. Cheap draw card. Do I have a card I want to remove? Not really. I like... I like my cards. Hmm. 
I like my cards, to be honest with you. I think they're all really good. Maybe I buy this. And I buy... Hmm. Takes effect up to two times per battle. Resets at the end of combat. I'm gonna take this just because I think it could help. But otherwise, I'm gonna walk away with just that. 50? Oh my god. Don't play games with those nightmare cards, by the way. Don't play games with those nightmare cards. <laughs> they are dangerous. Can't use it, but now it's back in play, so that's the important part.
I'm serious about both those. Don't fuck around with them. See, Dorami, once that counter goes down to zero, she's gonna start summoning other people, and that's when things get dangerous. Traceon is now free. Let's see. Three, four, five, six, seven, So much damage. Right, I forgot about Romilia's effect. Uh oh. Forgot about Romilia's effect. At least Junko isn't scary. Thank you, Junko. Thank you, Junko. <laughs> that was my last card. Unlocks the ability to fundraise. That was my last card. Tranquility. Easy. Keystone. When it gets hit, she gets too light. No defense cards played. That's not happening. Keystone. That'll activate off the scissor blade as well. Alright, I need to upgrade I need to upgrade my uh I need to upgrade. If only, right? If only that was shimmy. Pay 75, gain two same upgraded uncommon cards. Uh neutral cards. Monocolor. Two meditations. Cost zero and exile. At, so this card pays for itself, but with Peerless World, it becomes free. That's not bad. I actually think that's pretty good. I'm gonna hold on. I'm gonna hold that. I'm gonna hold that. All right. Fourteen. Add a needle. Take the AOE if you don't mind. 42, that is so unnecessary. No, that's unnecessary. I can't play that anymore because I don't have any light mana. Wait, yes I do, it's right here. Fucking gummy head.
Wow. Go ahead, pump my cost. See if I care. Forty-eight damage. I can't stop her debuff, unfortunately. I tried. I tried though. I yeah, I don't want to see the love sick girl. I really don't. <laughs> shame that one but it's okay you guys are really late are you kidding me oh reflection stays there I see I am going to kill you. Okay. 90. Edge of Fantasy. Whenever a card is exiled, gain 7 block. It's already upgraded. That includes status cards, by the way. Take it. Oh, my boss is Jinko. <laughs> my boss is Jinko. Felt this world plus, yes. Oh, thank God. I am going to live forever! I do not fear you! No, you should fear me! Oi, 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 oi. Hey, hold on, that kind of hurts. Hey, hold on, that kind of hurt a lot. Whoa, 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 chill, chill, chill. Dial it back. Dial it back, one second. Can I play that? Yeah, I can. I have my radiance back. I don't really want it actually. Mm, 
maybe don't. I'm okay, I'm alive. It tickles. It tickles! Tickles! It merely tickles! Alright, Fairy Rampage is gonna summon a new fairy. Oh, and it fully heals them, too. Well. This got awkward. I hurt. I hurt all over. Get rid of it. Hey, is it just me or are their numbers looking a little... Oh, the number's looking a little high. Bro, I'm still fine. I'm still fine. Can I have... What is in here? I need to pull something out of here. <laughs> Shit. That was a pretty good thing to pull out of there. <laughs> get rid of it. Get rid of it, get rid of it, get rid of it, get rid of it. Jesus Christ, dude. How does any character do that? <laughs> wow. Whenever Rainbow adds a card during combat, it is automatically upgraded. You gotta understand how good that is. You gotta understand, that's... That's a good card! Problem is, it costs everything I have. 
This, on the other hand, is a draw card, which I am severely lacking. So, I want a draw card. Make no mistake, Faithful Meditation is an extremely good card. This removes our vulnerable, which makes it really good. This makes the card choice better. This reduces the cost, but it's already being handled anyway. Hmm. I'm gonna get Trace on. Yeah, I don't have Barrier Slam. If I did, things would go significantly faster. Alright. And just, you know, just smack her. For 42 damage. I meant to use the spell card first. Well, whatever. It doesn't actually matter if I use it first or not. I'll get 100 back when I beat her. Hot Barrier up yet. Okay. Alright, now that Felt this world is in effect, it's okay. 60 damage. Surprisingly okay. There you go. Now. Nah. Wow. That's just... I guess 15 is better than nothing. barrier. Is there anything in here worth pulling out? I guess above the realm. Six damage. <laughs> Eighty four damage. I got to block it. I 
Can't play it, but I wanted the Radiance. Alright. I really wish I had draw cards, man, but it's all right. It's okay for now, but I don't, I barely have any cards to draw more cards with. Boy. Twenty-two block reflection. Kill Pesaneng, dude. 12 times 6. It doesn't even matter. Reimu is winning. Winning. Winning, 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 winning. I mean, I mean, do, do I need it? I'm taking it. Fuck it. Another crossing the border. Whenever Reimu gains block or barrier, deal damage. Yes, sir. Please sell me smart speaker. You are not the friend I thought you were. Damn it. Oh, my favorite card. Okay, hold on. When drawn, purify one. That's. Oh. I don't want that, is the thing. I can get rid of it. Uh, just thinking what I want to buy. Breaking Boundaries? I love that card. Um. Hmm. Yeah, it's a dead draw, so obviously you don't want that. Any color, it costs nothing. I really like this card, so I'm buying it and hoping that it bailed me out. And I have 76 left, so I can buy... I can buy the crazy block shield. Wait, that's a draw card. Okay. Okay. Let's think about this for a second. <laughs> more options, more damage. And you gain barrier when you draw upgraded cards while this is upgraded. Okay, no, we're getting that. All right. Oh my God. <laughs> All right. Okay, all right. All right.
I really just pulled built this world out of breaking boundaries. <laughs> wow. I don't want to keep the vulnerable. Goblet. Chip yourself. I don't need another one. I, I don't need another one. I don't need another one. I, I have enough. What is that? What the what? <laughs> uh. Yes, I can read.
I'm doing numbers! Absolutely eat my wiener. <sighs> Give me that crisp four damage. I need to start doing things though. Jesus. <laughs> that was way too stressful. What the hell was that bullshit with the key, dude? She pulled out she pulled out a, a double attack and was just like, yeah, I'm about to do 80. Deal with it. I wasn't ready to deal with it. God damn. <laughs> Oi, oi, oi. Dude, I really had the chance to get three Filthless Worlds, huh? But you know what? I started with the Hakuday Barrier and the Dechromatic Lotus Butterfly in my hand, which was really, really good. I don't... Chat, that was... That was so difficult. That was ridiculously difficult. I can't imagine that doing that with any other character because I had Raymond with cheat barrier. Did you see how much damage I was mitigating with my stupid barrier shit? What do other characters do in the face of that? No, 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 no. They don't. <laughs> they don't. So that's my win. That right there is my win. I got a whole... If I had taken the toolbox, it would have been a 100% pure mana run, huh? Shimada. Yeah, you need you need some crazy good luck. And got the killer super fast. It was cool I actually got to use a neutral mana deck though. I I'm glad that I got to show that off, but the deck was definitely carried by the Great Hawker Day Barrier because barrier like that is insane. But there you go, chat. I did it. Now I never have to do it again. You know the funny thing? You know, the funny thing, chat, is in the video I have, I'm currently sitting on it, obviously. Uh, the video I have of this game, I said in that video that I have yet to try any of the higher difficulties. That's, let that, let that be a, a time frame for when I finished that video. In that video, I said I have yet to try any of the higher difficulties, so I have no opinion on them. Meanwhile, here I am, and I... <laughs> <laughs> Just be lunatic. So a video will come out eventually, probably when I get my channel back, because you know, you know how this garbage works. But 
I'm going to take that win to the bank. And I think next time I play chat, I don't know if I want to try Lunatic runs again. I think I might try some Jade Box runs next time I play it instead. Because that was fucking ridiculous. Oh, that was that was ridiculous, man. I do have a thumbnail for it, actually. I got that thumbnail uh, two days before my channel disappeared. So, good, right? So, yeah, I'll probably try some Jade Box stuff next. I don't know if I want to play Lunatic anymore, though, because Lunatic is insane. That's insanely difficult. And it's just, unless, like, you got a min-max, but also you need good luck. And it's like, oh, God. I got lucky. I got so lucky. <laughs> but it's fine. I won.